The owl gives the, the, the main character, the, the character you play, um, all kinds of abilities. It's, a, it's a basically a flying, hovering attack drone that you can use to, to do things like attack, you can create shields, you can stun enemies, and it can even create zip lines. So there's lots of new different ways that you as a player can, 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 can use to tackle different situations. So in Kills and Shadow for multiplayer, uh, we want to give the power to to the users. We want to allow you to create your own what we call war zone. And war zone is basically a combination of all type of variables, like what, what what maps do you play, what missions do you play, all the way down to what weapons do you carry, and which classes are allowed. We as Gorilla, we're going to actively look at the community. We're going to actively find interesting combinations that the users have made and then put them on the front page. So we're going to actively promote all kinds of cool things that, that the community builds. We like the idea of kind of rebooting the visual style a little bit because it's a new game, it's a new, new platform, it's next gen. Uh, see what we can do uh, with all that extra power. And it was also more in the future this time, so we had to also introduce a few elements to make it a little bit more uh, advanced looking as well. <laughs> so we were very fortunate to have a fantastic cast. Um, we have David Harewood uh, out, of, out of Homeland, uh, a TV, a TV show. Uh, he played the CIA director there. He plays the VSA director uh, in, in this title. So it's, a, it's quite a similar role, but he really kind of brings that power and authority. He's, he's an authority figure. He's somebody who has a strong kind of will and an agenda. He needs to keep his people safe. So he's really going for that. On the other side, we have uh, another important character, which is called Echo. Uh, she's a Hellgast operative. She's very much kind of your mirror image, your Echo, if you will. And she's being played by Jamie Gray Hyder uh, of True Blood uh, TV show. And she's a fantastic fit for her for that role. She's really powerful. She really kind of portrays the Hellgast side really well and gives it kind of a, a real human face. We want to be a launch title. We've never done, we've never done that, but it's so important that, that we could kind of flex our muscle on kind of some new hardware because it's creatively it's really inspiring uh, because the boundaries that you knew are all of a sudden going to be extended and it's you're breaking new ground you're trying to come up with all of these new things it's 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 daunting it's exciting it's scary uh, but it's it's very much creatively it's a it's a real challenge so it's something that we were really kind of looking for uh, and on the tech side on the on the visual side on the design side we're trying to all push kind of the boundaries and everybody's claiming kind of their own little piece and saying we, we really want to push this area and i think uh, Hopefully, when people start playing the game, they will see that all of these different areas form a whole and it, and it feels like a complete new experience. <laughs> 